This is Josh Wins 13, and I'm here to welcome you to Balboa Park Golf. I need to introduce you to somebody. This dude is special, man. His name is Nick Neal, and he is a three-time club champion from Torrey Pines. He is one of the best amateur golfers in the entire country, let alone the entire city of San Diego. His current handicap index is plus 5.5, which is insane. He's won three out of the last four club championships at Torrey Pines. In fact, the only year he did not win the Torrey Pines Club Championship was the year that Mike Marin won. And Mike, as you know, is also the two-time club champion from Balboa Park Golf. So it's pretty safe to say that Mike and Nick are two of the best golfers in all of San Diego. And you're about to watch them play right now. So John, as a past club champion for Tory, have you heard the news? Our club champion, Mike Marin, has agreed to a rivalry match with the current club champion of Tory Pines. Nick Neal? Yes, Nick and Mike are gonna go one round here, one round there for the battle of the Muni. I tell you, Nick is an exceptional player, and so is Mike, for that matter. I remember, because I used to run the club championship there. You know, answer your question. Nick can get comfortable on this golf course with Nick. He's so strong and long, he can have no problem. I would go, no offense to Mike, but I would go with Nick. When did you start playing? When I was 14. 14? Yeah. Oh, he's got a big head start. <laughs> he's like, before school, can I hit a bucket? Oh, really? Yeah. Wow. Any tips for the junior, for the young, aspiring golfer? Don't take it too seriously. Don't be too hard on yourself. You know, it's easy to get upset with yourself. Just have fun with it? Yeah. Just enjoy it. You know, you can practice and hard and everything, but just have fun. Play without fear. Enjoy it. Don't worry about score so much. Now, you just won the Torrey Pines Club Championship, right? Yeah. How many rounds is the uh, club championship for Torrey? 39 time on. Uh, this year was three rounds. Three rounds? Yeah. Uh, which courses? Two rounds on the north, one on the south. And what'd you shoot on those three rounds? 67, 68, 72. So nine, nine under total. Nine under over three. And which, uh, which round was it south? The last, 70, 72. All right, that's obviously a pretty solid. So nine under, what was second place? One under. Okay, so you won by eight, eight strokes. Eight shots. Now, now for this event, right, it's a club champion versus club champion, but each club champ got to pick a partner. Why'd you pick Matt? He's a senior club champ and good buddy. Yeah, so what's, what's, the, what's, the, what's the skill? What, what does he bring to the table, like, skill-wise? Like, what, do you, what are you looking for from him today? I mean, you're... <laughs> uh, skill-wise, oh, definitely short game. Putting and chipping's his, his forte, generally. Yes. All right, what's your USGA handicap index? Uh, currently, I think it's like plus 5.5. <laughs> have you, all right, I, I, I gotta admit, I knew the answer to that one before I asked you the question, and I've been spending the last month literally trying to find a single person with a better index than that, and I've been unsuccessful. You if know, only I could bring, if anyone? I could bring it to the tournaments, that would be nice. Try to ignore me unless, you know, I ask you a good question or something like that. But as I said, it's all about pace of play here. We're trying to go as fast as possible, you know. Unless, well, there's, unless you can't hit We had no ball. issue with that. All, all these guys play fast. So. Oh, 100%, 100%. Hey, thanks, man. It's hey, great bro. to meet you, Nick. Now, Nick, you train, you're like a physiologist, right? And you train pe people on how to be better physically at golf? Exactly. That's pretty awesome. Yeah. And if somebody wanted to hire you or to learn more, where would they go? Uh, to my website. And is that golfstronghitbombs.com? Exactly. All right, perfect. There will be a link. <laughs> so if you want to be able to hit balls like Nick, go there. Yeah. <laughs> at least, uh, at least better. It should should make you feel better than isn't you do right now. That's JVD, for sure. isn't that what you do? Mike dish Mike dishing to everyone today. <laughs> what clubs are in your bag, Nick? Ah, uh, 60, 56, 51, 46, 9 through 4. It's like a two and a half hybrid, like 19 degree, and then 15 degree three wood, driver 9 degree. I just cracked the face on my Sim 2, so I got a, I got, I upgraded the QI 10 now.
I'm current. I'm current with my driver finally. What kind of clubs do you have in your bag? Uh, just some old AP2s and uh, <clears throat> a, a couple wedges, right? I'm not a new equipment guy. Do you have a favorite club? Yeah, my 58 degree. 58? Hey, that sounded familiar. <laughs> that sounded familiar. All right, just call you the 58s. Uh, yeah, he's, he's, cool. he's pretty good around the greens. What club do you usually hit on the first tee here, Nick? Usually either a four iron or a hybrid. No driver, huh? No, it's too narrow up there. There's no, the risk makes the reward not worth it. Got it. It's just a, it's just a wedge in, so. Yeah, it depends. On a cold day like this, I might hit, I might hit hybrid or a foggy morning. The air's pretty heavy. Is it that far? Oh, wow. <laughs> you want me to go? Yeah, if you're saying the visitors can leave it. Okay. Nice shot. Thanks. Short of it. Oh, it flew all the way to it. Just left. See, that's what I mean. That was just a light hybrid that flew all the way there. Yeah, that can't be 253. Yeah, try it. That's like that's like a two 245 shot. Oh, 210. <laughs> <laughs> that's crazy. I think you'll fly all the way to the junk. <laughs>